It's 7 a.m. from Fox 35. This is Good Day Orlando. All right, forget the flashlight and the fear of running out of batteries. Tonight, when you head out trick-or-treating, just tap into that flashlight app on your phone, right? A lot of people use it, but did you know there could be a security risk associated with it? Those free apps could actually be stealing your personal data. Our good friend and tech expert Tom Jelnick from On Target Web Solutions joining us right now to explain why that is and how to protect yourself. Great to, Great to see you. you. As always, Tom. So this is a little scary. Yeah. How, does, how does this work exactly? This, this is the dark side of the flashlight. Light. Oh boy. Yeah, so <laughs> here's the thing. Um, people are downloading apps all day long. Right. And a flashlight's really appealing. Um, Jamie King would love this, but when I go fishing at night and you have to tie a knot, it's almost impossible unless you have a flashlight. So you use your smartphone, right? Right. <clears throat> so what's happening here? People are downloading, downloading this app, and the app says, I want to access your microphone, or I want to access your contacts. I don't think flashlights need access to that stuff. <laughs> so it will ask you these questions, the app will ask you these questions, and then unknowingly you will agree to it? Well, nobody reads these things, and uh. that's the problem. So, you know, anything that's free can be dangerous. And, and, you know, my dad taught me that growing up. If it's free, nothing in life is free. <laughs> so you really have to stop and ask yourself, does a flashlight need to access my contacts? So what happened here, a whole bunch of people's phones are being compromised. Data is being sent to China, Oof. and they're mining all of your personal data. Wow, and it's of freaky. course that happens, and your identity can be stolen, right. your credit cards, everything is in there. 100%. That's a scary thing, and it's not just flashlight apps, Amy. It's you know, last time your child picked up your phone and downloaded a a free game. Mm -hmm. Well, they're just clicking, click, 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 and then before you know it, your phone's being compromised. They know your GPS location because that's turned on. They can listen into your phone conversations via the microphone. They can even turn on the camera and take pictures of you. Ooh. So it's freaky. So what do you need to do? What can you do? Anything? A, a lot of common sense needs to be applied here. So before you start downloading stuff, I always Google the app just to make sure it's kind of legit and safe. What about reading the reviews? I always read the reviews. Okay. That's important too. Okay. So um, you'll see if people feel uh, skittish about downloading it just by reading. Mm -hmm. um, and certainly, again, use Google. Google can be your friend, you know, to vet these particular apps to make sure that, yeah, this is safe. Um, and the onboard flashlight on the Apple is perfectly safe, just okay. for the record. Okay, right. good to know. All right, so All right. if you got that, you should be good. You're in good shape. Oh, it is frightening. Tom Jelnick. Your website, please. It is ontargetwebsolutions.com. Great. Great to see you. Happy Halloween you to too. you. All right, 740.